Look at this delicious meal. Let's see what must happen to turn this food into fuel for your body. Digestion begins when food enters the body through your mouth. Your tongue moves the food around to where your teeth can chew it into small pieces and reduce it to a small soft ball ready for swallowing. This is called mechanical digestion. Your tongue has several main functions. It helps chew food. It helps you swallow food. Its surface is covered with taste buds to help you experience various tastes. The edges are for sour and acid. The front is for salty and sweet. The back is for bitter. And your tongue also helps to form sounds by moving freely up and down as you speak. Does the thought of your favorite foods make your mouth water? Well, that water in your mouth is not really water. It's saliva. Saliva is a juice made by your salivary glands. As we chew, saliva moistens the food, softening it. Saliva also contains enzymes. Why are enzymes important in the digestive system? Enzymes are chemicals. Chemical digestion helps change food into usable forms. The enzymes in saliva change starch, a carbohydrate, into sugar, which is more easily digested. This is called chemical digestion. Now the food goes to the back of your throat, or pharynx, ready to be swallowed. This is the opening to both the esophagus, which leads to the stomach, and the windpipe, or trachea, which leads to the lungs. A flap of cartilage, known as the epiglottis, presses down against the trachea when you swallow to keep the food out of it. This is why you can't breathe and swallow at the same time. Place your hand on your neck and swallow. Can you feel movement? That movement of what we call our Adam's apple is the movement of the trachea shifting so that it is covered by the epiglottis when you swallow. After you swallow, food passes into the esophagus, a passageway for food between mouth and stomach. Muscles in the walls of your esophagus push the food toward your stomach in a wave-like motion. This process is called peristalsis. Could you swallow your food if you were upside down? Yes. No matter how you stand or move, the food you've swallowed keeps moving along to your stomach. Take out your paper now for more questions. Question 5. What is the juice made by your salivary glands called? Six, chemical digestion helps change food into usable forms. What are the chemicals called? Seven, the passageway for food between the mouth and stomach is called the Eight, muscles in the walls of your esophagus push the food toward your stomach in a wave-like motion. What is this process called? Here are the answers. Five, the juice made by your salivary glands is called saliva. Six, the chemicals that help change food into usable forms are called enzymes. 7. The passageway for food between the mouth and stomach is called the esophagus. 8. Peristalsis is the wave-like motion that pushes your food toward your stomach.